Today, I'm gonna show you guys how to make this very elegant unicorn birthday cake. Hi, welcome to Cake Mom. I'm Abby, and today I'm making my niece's fifth birthday cake. Hope I had that right. Fifth. <laughs> Happy birthday, Eliana, I love you. <laughs> we made this, right? And I'm gonna show you how we did it from start to finish. It's a pineapple cake with some guava lime filling and just a vanilla Swiss meringue buttercream. This particular cake is dye free because we had some special requests for that. Before we get into the video, don't forget to subscribe if you like what you're seeing. Hit the notification bell if you want to see more and let's get to it. All right, so we are going to make a filling for this cake. It is guava and lime. I went to the store and I found some guava preserves. They also had guava marmalade. I'm not sure the difference. I'm, so I got preserves. And I got some limes. And I'm going to beat the two together. Like, that smells good. It smells like guava. I've done it from paste before. And honestly, it's a lot of work. So I don't suggest that. I mean, you can if you want to. All right, so I'm gonna mix this up really good. I'm gonna mix this up really good until all the clumps have disappeared because I don't want clumps. I'm gonna squeeze some limes in this bowl. Right here. Come on. What's up? I'm gonna start with the juice from one lime and then taste it and see how it is. It just tastes like guava. So I'm gonna add some more lime. This is the worst knife in the history of knives. Are you all done? Oh, you want this one? So guava and lime classic combo. Much better. Perfect. Two limes. Don't forget that. All right, it's time for a caker hack. Caker hack. It's a new thing. Hashtag cake hack. Condiment bottle from Walmart. It'll cost you about a dollar. You can use this for pretty much any filling or ganache or whatever you have that you're working on. So this is our filling. This is our frosting. Some Swiss meringue buttercream, just vanilla. And here's some cake. It's pineapple cake. I mean, just can't get more tropical than pineapple and guava. All right, so I'm going to stack and fill this, and then I'm gonna to show you guys how to decorate this fabulous unicorn cake. It's gonna be awesome. Emery's joined the party over here and we're gonna decorate this unicorn cake. For the top portion of the unicorn cake, it's gonna be the face. So we're just gonna do smooth frosting. So here we go. So this is as smooth as I need to make this because it's gonna have other decorations on it. So I'm gonna stop here, I'm gonna throw it in the fridge and start on the bottom tier. So I have dirty ice, stacked, filled, everything to this. I'm going to reinforce this tier since there is a second tier on top of this. I'm gonna ah. stick some straws in here, so oh. get ready. All right, so I'm gonna take a schmooge of frosting and put it right here so that my second tier stays put. So next up, we're gonna give this unicorn some unicorn hair. <laughs> Sounds really weird. <laughs> Basically, I'm just going to, I've got a star tip on here, a very large star tip. It's a big star. And I'm just gonna kinda draw a bunch of different squiggly things with this. It's gonna be good. 
right, here we go. All right, so now we're gonna work on the face and the mane. I've chosen the side I want my face on, which is right here. And the mane's gonna kinda come this way. But I'm gonna have to turn it around for me to be able to see it, so. So that's the kind of center point here. I'm gonna work backwards. Okay, so this particular cake the family asked for no artificial dyes. I went and got these awesome clay unicorn toppers from Amazon. All right. This particular kit came with these adorable little eyelashes. Now, you can make these yourself or you can pipe some on, but I thought these were cute and glittery, so I'm gonna put them on there. All right, that's it. I hope you found this very informative and maybe you can make your own unicorn birthday cake. If you do, tag me, show me, I wanna see it. <laughs> if you have any questions or any ideas on some new videos, please consider, you know, giving me a comment. I'd love to see. <laughs> anyway, this has been fun. I hope you enjoyed it. Check out my other videos. Have a great one.